Welcome back, everybody. I'm Jade Monkey. We're back here in Rust, and today we're talking about the Rust console beta for the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One, the Rust console beta. And we are fast approaching the beta, but uh, we're going over some not clues. The TC, the tool cupboard clue that keeps popping up. This is our third video on this, and we just kind of want to walk through some of the logic. Now, yes, this is all speculation. We don't know. Uh, we're debunking some of the speculation currently just because we've heard a lot of stuff on our live streams about it. And we just wanted to cover uh, the bases now. And, uh, you know, if you've already seen this, you probably know what we're going to be saying here. But this is for the people that maybe don't know. So just a caveat here. Um, we are super excited for this to come. I hope this does come on the 23rd of July. I hope this does come during, you know, whatever quarter the TC is quote unquote saying that it is. We're just trying to walk through some logic to, sh to tell you that some of this information that's floating around the Internet isn't necessarily accurate or true. It's just kind of fabrications. And, um, yeah, so let's go over that. So, I'm again, I'm Jade Monkey. I'm here with Razor from RazorTube, part of the Boyfriend Squad. Say hello. What's up, everybody? Hi! All right, let's get down to the base. Yeah, right, let's go. Gotta, let's, let's race. Yeah. You want some? Let's go. I'm going to totally go. beat you right now. Oh, I hit the pole. I hit the tree. It's not last. It's not first, you're last. <laughs> oh, I'm going to flip. Oh, whoa, this car's out of control fast. <gasps> Demon. I said barrel roll. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I have oh, to dude, run over after up. this. Oh, oh my I goodness. I don't want to crash into your base. <gasps> you can do it. It's okay. I made it. No. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> uh, somehow I made it. Somehow I made it. Okay, so... Um, up the ramp. You like that? That's pretty good. <laughs> All right, let's place on a TC here so you can see what we're talking about. So the reason why we're debunking this to say that this is linked to the 23rd thing. Now, again, we want this to happen on the 23rd. Heck, we want this to happen like today or Tonight. tomorrow. Yeah, like we right want now. this as soon as possible. Let's be honest. I've been telling my chat and I've been telling Razor. I was like, I would trade every video I've ever done for Rust to just know when this is coming out or to have I, it come I out. I would trade my YouTube channel. Yeah, I would, in a heartbeat, <laughs> do that. So here's the thing that everybody's talking about. And I get, like, it kind of makes sense, but then it kind of, like, pulls away. So, like, if you haven't played this game long enough, you wouldn't necessarily know um, that these things would, would be there. And, again, I know we this is our third video on this, but it keeps coming up. So I, I don't know where it's coming from, but uh, right here it says Rust, ba Rust Beta Release Date. I think my, my quality is turned way down. Can you guys see it? Can you see it right here? So... And normally this would make sense, but like if if you haven't played, you'd be like, oh, okay, maybe. But that's a Half-Life 3 symbol, okay? Um, Half-Life symbol, and then the 3 down there in the corner. Sorry, I think my textures are turned way down because it looks like potatoes, but you get the idea. <laughs> yeah. And so th this was a, a joke that the developers had saying that this would never come out of early access or beta. And this was way before the game was even released, before there was even an announcement that the, the beta was coming for the consoles. This is them knocking on themselves. And they're saying this would come uh, before or after, or no, I'm sorry, after Half-Life 3 or something like that. So it's something around Half-Life 3, which isn't out. And this game yeah, has already left, yeah, it's already left beta already for the PC. This is a fully functional, fully live game. And, at the, and this has been here for years. So there's oh, no yeah. way they could have predicted the timetables. And the fact that the whole like uh, uh, lockdown situation that everybody's in right now, we would never know. The fact that the whole announcement here happened, do you think they really knew three years ago or two years ago that A, they wouldn't be at E3, and B, they'd have to make their own event, and then they would know the exact date of the event to throw down and then say, yep, let's just, th three years in advance, <laughs> let's, let's, let's yeah. predict a pandemic, let's predict... Yeah. Um, not, <laughs> us not being an E3, like, none of that makes sense. And, like, uh, part of it's like this, you know, there's a triangle, uh, Illuminati confirmed, it smells like bacon, it's coming out Tuesday. Like, yeah. there has to be some form of logic there, and I'm not trying to knock on it. I want this to come out ASAP. But, like, the fact that it's just these crazy things, it's like, if you turn this sideways, it's a three, and yeah. then it's a whatever. I'm like, dude, this has been here for years. And the fact that they mm -hmm. can predict this three years ahead of time is lunacy. So Not to mention, I don't think they would a actually put a Easter egg sticky note on a TC in order to reveal when the council beta is coming out. That basically they're like, 
we know the exact timeline that it's going to be from when our games on early access on PC all the way till the beta on console after the full release of the PC version. There is absolutely 110% no studio out there that could predict that that in advance. I could tell you that right now. And and that's not, you know, I'm not hey, if it comes out the 23rd like Jade said, cool I'm story, down. bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm down. down for it. I'm down for it now. I mean, release it right now, Gary. Where you at? Well, you know what I mean? We're trying to say it doesn't follow the logic of like why they would put yeah. it on there. None of this fits. And let's be honest, there, there are there are two studios working on this. Double Eleven, which is a veteran studio for doing ports. Mm. And like the fact that one studio having the IP and like developing it by themselves, that's a hard that's a hard sell, right? To to do. Yeah. But then they coordinate two studios and the fact that this this whole event has been shifted by the current situation, the current lockdown. The fact that E three they pulled out what was it at the end of last year or something? So they, there's no way they would have known by the time this appeared, which was at least two years and change ago. They never knew all those things in advance. So it's it's yeah. virtually impossible. Now, could it? Could we get information on the 23rd? Sure. Would it be based around that? Maybe. But there's no way the TC has that. It would be 100% happenstance. There's no yeah. way because that 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 little TC thing has been there for so long and has not changed. So there's yep. no way. It would be the luckiest every, thing in the world. Everybody knows that, too. Anybody who's been watching us or who's been a veteran player in Rust knows that. Like, it's it's been a joke for years. So, like, is it a coincidence being on the TC and then there's a console beta? Mm, not really. Not, not in my opinion. But, I mean, it's like they didn't even know they were going to come to console until they got this where it is today. So... Hey, you know years, what I mean? Yeah, two years ago, when they, like, even, like, I, I even want to say it was three years ago, when that at first appeared, I think it might, it might even be longer than three, when that first yeah. appeared in the game, they they were toying around, too. okay, so just to give you a timeline, not to drag this out too far, but uh, two years ago, they were experimenting with Double Eleven to see if it was even possible to get this game to run. In its current, like, build, with all the cool things, with all the vanilla stuff, the cars, the, the application, the building... The, the helicopters, all that new stuff that's been added, they had to weigh in and say, look, can these current generation consoles handle this? And they were testing it two years ago, and the commit list shows that. So there's literally no way. It would be 100% happenstance. There's like just no possibility of that being a planned out thing. It would be just a coincidence, it, plain and simple. Yeah. There's no other way to explain that. So like along that logic, that's where we're like, hey, I don't think that's an Easter egg at all, but do we want this thing to come on the 23rd? Heck yeah, we do. And wh why are people saying this is on the 23rd? There's supposed to be a, an Xbox showcase event on the July 23rd, depending on when you watch this video, and there may be an announcement there, but I heard that that particular announcement is for exclusives. I could be wrong. I don't know. I, again, we want this thing to be announced. We want nothing more than to be playing this thing or at least get some information that's like, okay, on Tuesday it's coming. Like, we want to know. So, like, the fact that this event is for Xbox, yes, there's a small possibility it could be displayed there, but it, there's a 0% possibility if it's just an exclusive event, if that makes sense, because this game is for PlayStation 4 and for Xbox. There's no exclusivity. There's no delayed release. They are at the same time. Gary has said that yep. since 2013 when he first said, hey, we're thinking about doing this, and I don't want this to be some cut-down version of the game. I want this to be full-blown for PlayStation 4 and Xbox. I was like... Do it, brother. Do it. We want yeah. that too. It's it's all it's all like if we did get news on the twenty third, it wouldn't be because it's a ta that uh, TC sticking out is attached to something that's making it relevant. The TC thing is just would be a coincidence, and it wouldn't play up any type of role in any information released on the twenty third for the Xbox uh, Live event. So I mean. Jay, you know, Jade and I have been talking about this for months now, and it, pretty much what's out there and, uh, on the internet, it's it's it, it's it's false. It's fabricated. It's there's nothing there that could even make it seem like that was yeah. like a, 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 an it's, idea. It's digging. It's digging. Had. Like, we yeah. make speculation, but I like to be pretty forthcoming with, like, what is. And let's be honest. Like, we want this game out so bad, there has been no official words, so we're only left to speculate. So, I Just like to... wait till we get it on console, dude. 
I, I, yeah, Either like way. we're we're all about like looking up the stuff on the commit list to say, look, what is possible that could be coming out of this? We don't know because mm. there has been a no announcement. We'll let you know when it does happen because we're just as excited as you guys are. But anyways, that's the TC rundown. Um, sorry you guys had to watch this a third time for people that have been longtime viewers, but we just had to clear it up. But we are excited for this. And I know RazorTube and I, uh, the Boyfriend Squad, we will be streaming this on PC until it comes out on console or even the beta, and then we will be playing it, uh, we'll be maining this on console if you didn't know. Um, but we're basically stuck playing it on the PC until then, so, uh, you know, you can come by, check us out on the streams. <laughs> Look at this. Did you come back over here? We'll be uh, <laughs> checking it out. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> We'll be checking it. You guys can come by and check us out on stream if you guys have questions about stuff. Um, we'll be more than happy to answer it. And uh, we have playlists and stuff to get you guys ready for uh, the Rust Council beta, how to play Rust, because it is it's a pretty unique game. So, uh, you know, things like base As building. As you can tell. <laughs> yeah, things like base building. I'll go ahead and link like a base building guide or getting started beginner's guide for base building now in the upper right hand corner. And uh, hopefully we'll see you guys in the next live stream slash video. Bye. Okay, I love you. Bye.